Why don't people just, you know, think on their own and, and not be programmed by nefarious people online? Why don't they just do that? Why don't they just... <laughs> that wasn't as good as Tim's Ooh. earlier, but, you know. Oh. <laughs> hey, I liked it. All right, pretty, what do we have this week? To top that. This week we have, uh, this is actually from Boudreaux, who I know is listening in Discord right Yo, now. Boudreaux. Hello, Boudreaux. <laughs> Wait, yeah, I'll take the high oh. note, you take the low note. Actually, wait, Boudreaux's anyway. not in there right now. He's Boudreaux. not in there at all. Oh, we lost the Boudreau. We lost boot. We lost the Boudreau. <laughs> well, he's missing out because we're talking about him. So he uh, posted in the Discord, why don't they just chant? Is it channel or server? Uh, no, it's Discord. It's thing. It's the thing in the place. He says, uh, why don't they just show the telemetry for both stage one and stage two when SpaceX does their first stage separation? It would be really cool to see the stage one telemetry on descent. I'm, I'm confused by this, actually, because I thought they did do that. Uh, I'll, I'll set the record and say they currently do not. Okay. Um, is this the uh, like speed and altitude when he means telemetry? Yep. yep. Okay. So you're only seeing what's the the part that is still continuing on the mission, right? You're only seeing the mission telemetry, not what the stage one <clears throat> coming back see. is doing or whatever. Here, I'll, I'll just pull up. Yeah, I will pull up a thing and let you guys watch it and then see I if you guys can... To- Oh, wait. Yeah, you're sharing your screen. Let me show you guys. This is the last launch from SpaceX. Let's just kind of take a look. You'll notice there is only one bit of telemetry, and it is uh, currently stage two telemetry, even on Mm. ascent. So then when we go to, like, you know, when when they separate here, it continues with stage two, does not show stage one telemetry. Okay. For some reason, I thought they did. Did they used to? (sighs) Well, they have. SpaceX NROL 76, I believe they followed. <laughs> wow. Stage one. You actually just knew that off the top of your head. <laughs> Dude, this is my job, man. Like this uh. is I think so. Let's see. Let's see. Now now that we're putting my internet through the paces. I thought your job was yeah. to come in. Come on, on Tim. China's I thought you uh, had this thought you had this, you know, fancy internet. Here we go. Here's stage one. And I believe, if I remember right, this shows stage one. Up and down. Yep, look at that. Yeah, yeah. So they have done it. <laughs> and they can, of course, do it. So oh. why don't they just? So, so this was 2017. So why don't they just show both? Well, I feel like when we watched the Falcon Heavy launch in the Cape there, Joe and I, didn't we see how telemetry on those coming down? Because I feel like we knew exactly that. Like we could look at the TV and see the altitude of those boosters oh maybe I don't, I'm wrong. I don't remember that yeah because i remember you know at some point you can't see and then all of a sudden they they do the thing yeah. where they split off and you're like oh i saw something and then they're coming back down and i feel like we we looked over and somehow knew how far up they were maybe i'm wrong maybe they had a special thing mm-hmm. going for us but here's falcon heavy yep there's the arab set 6a that was ours and so notice, it just has the one stage two telemetry yeah. stage two telemetry hmm yeah. Why don't they do it? They clearly can. I've showed you videos where there's stage two <laughs> and there's stage one. Because that's not the important part. The important part is getting the thing to space. Well, yeah. Because we haven't <laughs> demanded it. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't they just get it to not cut out the signal when the booster lands? Why don't they just, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I still they, wonder. They've been, they've been doing pretty good with that lately. The last few, it, it seems like yeah. they've kept the signal. Sorry. Go yeah. On. Definitely. I still do wonder because there is a crew nearby, right? Ten miles away. Well, okay, whatever. I, I I still would love to see them put maybe another camera ship next to the drone ship that's just trailing it. You know, it's just dragging it along, so you can actually see it from, let's say, I don't know, yeah. five hundred yards away. Have it land, kind of just a different perspective. I think they that would just be a really cool once. shot. Yeah, they, they, there's a shot out there from. From the side that that was is a, like just in like, some of their promos. That was a chase plane with a huge lens. The oh, chase wow, plane was okay. on the edge of the exclusion zone, and that's expensive to do because those planes, sure, with yeah. you know, huge, probably I uh, literally multi million dollar gimbal, you know, like to be able to yeah. keep it perfectly steady. Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. That's CRS eight landing footage. Yeah, I just think um, it's so cool. I, I would just still love some that of my angle. favorite, still some of my favorite stuff to look at because this shot is unbelievable but yeah that one's cost you know 
right there constraints yeah. Yeah. uh you know of, of cost constraints like they can't afford to fly a plane on the edge of the exclusion zone for every mission it adds just millions could, of dollars s- s- send a send a camera crew hold on wait a, we're getting way off track of the original why don't they just <laughs> we've done this before we can do this next week it's go ahead write it on twitter whoever's listening and we'll talk all about why they don't just cover the landings and a different thing why don't they have stage one and stage two telemetry you're you're asking like you know the answer. Do you know the answer? Because <laughs> there's not guess. enough room on the screen. There's a, a a policy. You can only have a certain number of numbers on the screen during a SpaceX broadcast. About That's that? actually about the closest reason, to be honest. There you go. I know for a fact that there has been some uh, interface, like graphics, proposed that show stage one and stage two. And so far, nothing has really made it past like this looks good and isn't really uh, confusing. Uh, that that's one of the reasons. There's actually some technical reasons too about the the downlink and stuff that just makes it kind of hard to to do it and hard to do it graphically. Um, but I, I I think the the biggest one of the biggest answers is they they haven't found a way to to do it pleasingly and not in a way that looks v- hmm. decent. Which sounds ridiculous. I know people are probably like no, but like <laughs> that's We're expecting some it. real technical answer here. It's just like <laughs> hey, we just don't like it. Yeah, we just don't we don't want to do it. <laughs> hasn't you, made you it. Don't, you don't win an Emmy if it looks bad, okay? Exactly. <laughs> this is Elon Musk. It's got to look good. It's got to, you know, make sense. Now, uh, and some of it, too, is uh, there's been speculation that, like, the one that we showed where it shows the booster, that one can easily be tracked and shown, but some of their further, more um, high-energy landings that are a lot harder to do, that they wouldn't want to show the telemetry from that because they kind of have some secret sauce and how they're actually able to you know, to do, to perform those landings. So if someone were to really, mm-hmm. truly study the telemetry, they could probably learn a little bit of their trade secrets too, is some of the speculation on on why they wouldn't show stage one on some of those um, like GTO and, and high energy missions as well. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching this clip from our show. If that's just not enough for you and you want to watch the full episode, you can go to olfpod.com slash YT. And if you want more from us, you can consider becoming a Patreon member. You'll get early access to episodes. You can join our awesome community. You can actually watch us record live and get your name in the credits by going to olfpod.com slash Patreon. So thanks, everyone, for watching. Check back every Friday for new clips here and new episodes on the main channel. Thanks, everybody.